uh, during my work in Ralph Lauren, they used to call me the hand. So I created an image of my own and became Ralph Lauren Prince, as well as my future, who I paint anything because of the way that I see it, the way that I paint. It's uh, personal. What's your name? Sutke. When I was growing up, they called me the artist. People would wait until the class finished. They would pick up my art with a signature on it and run away. It's an interesting thing that I actually I was feeling a little um, gloomy and I was painting this piece. Uh, it's called Birds of Paradise. Days, weeks, months goes by very fast. Life gets shorter and shorter. One day you will remember me from my paintings that will make me happy. My first memory is really a sad one. I always uh, drew something on somewhere, but most of the time it was my father's books. And then one day he picks up his book and he says, what have you done? He didn't punish me, because I knew I was the artist. I became very uh, involved with painting the neighborhood in Boston. It reminds me of my school years in Oxford and London. The interesting thing is the bricklayers are the most amazing artists. With my paintings, I use the impression over the brush strokes as they are bricks. That's the irony that I create with my paintings, is I'm not really copying what I see, I'm painting what I feel, how beautiful it is. So what's this? The taste is choice moment between guys? My orange, using the orange so much in my uh, buildings is um, you have to be an artist to see that moment when the sun is so strong and it hits it on the bricks and um, warm beautiful Boston sun and it turns into orange to me and then the shade areas are darker so so a lot of people go wow bricks are in that color I'm like well you didn't see it at the moment when it turns that color because that's when it's beautiful it's like art. Ever since Eden, the garden has been a symbol of heaven on earth. When I'm painting, I'm so close to it, I feel like I'm inside the painting, like a butterfly or a bee or something. Another thing is, most of these paintings, the new ones, that they are transparent. The leaves are not true leaves. They are very modern, different see-through shapes. So you can see the background from the front all the way through the back of the canvas. Most of the times I paint from photographs. I see the moment of the painting and capture it with the camera. And then I know what I exactly I'm gonna do with it. I did grow up in a small town, but a very uh, known family. I used to be called uh, not with my first name, I'm always son or grandson. And uh, it kind of bothered me for a while. And uh, so that's one of the reasons that I left Turkey. So I want to be an individual artist to make my name around the world. Because it's my interest, art, and every part of the art I love as I grow up. When I grow older, I feel that my art should be representing me even up after I am here. And I want to be known as the versatile artist who can paint and who wants to paint everything.